Hi guys, uh, we're in the kitchen as you can probably tell, kettle, uh, chocolate, something or other there. Anyway, um, I'm just seeing if putting a super capacitor in the circuit will enable the music box to start running on low power. At the moment, the super capacitor is charging up very slowly. So we're showing 0.6. If I wait here long enough, that'll go up to 0.061. That's um, millivolts, isn't it? So we've got a long way to go before we're up to something like one and a half volts, which is what it needs. I suppose I could try pre-charging the supercapacitor, but that would seem to be cheating. So we'll we'll just leave it and see if it charges up. It was on 0 0.4, 0 0.04 earlier on, so it has gone up a bit. But that's got an awfully long way to go before it's up to one and a half volts. This is just to see if we can do it without uh, buying a new solar panel. <laughs> Getting all excited, it just went up to 0 0.061. So yeah, it is definitely charging, just incredibly slowly. I've made a change. I've disconnected the motor, and I'm just charging the supercapacitor directly off the solar panel. And that is going up a bit quicker now. Still only up to half a volt, but... That's a lot quicker than it was going with the motor in circuit. So we'll just let it charge up and then we'll see if we can actually run the motor or the music box directly off the supercapacitor. Right, it's been charging for, I don't know, half an hour or so. One point nine volts. That might be enough to do it. So what I'll do is I'll plug the supercapacitor straight into the, or well, hold it straight across the terminals. I should think that's all I need to do. If I can get it off there without shorting it out. In fact, we'll bring that down here somewhere. Get all the wires out of the way. Move the camera. All right, I will just hold it straight across the terminals. Are we ready? So there we go, it does work off a supercapacitor. Uh, I'll just disconnect my wireless microphone, or no, how about... We'll put it just there, if you can still hear me. I don't know how long it'll last for on there, but that wasn't the idea. The idea was for the sun to charge that up. And once it's reached a high enough voltage, it should start running anyway, in theory. But it was taking so long to charge up because obviously the motor itself being straight across it is actually short circuiting it and reducing the power. I'll just see if I can yeah, right. All right, microphone back on me glasses in case you've never seen before. 
that's where they are. I found that if I put them on my collar, I tend to knock the microphone while I'm working. Anyway, what we'll do is we'll plug this back into the solar panel. And then see if we can jam this and the back of the terminals. Right. So we're look, what we're looking at there is will it keep running with the power that's coming in from the halogen light? I'm just walking away finding a clock. Okay. So it is nine o'clock at the moment. I will leave this running with the light on and see how long it takes to run down. I think it is slowing down. I don't think I'm gonna have to wait that long. And the other thing I did mention in one of the previous videos was changing the comb, as I call it. The thing that makes the noise, not the drum, the comb, because that one sounds a different tone to the original. Tidy away me wiring while that's running down. just realized having tidied my meter away I could have left it on there and could see what voltage it stops on Thank you. 
I think I'll have to put this video on my other channel and leave it full length. Surely it's going to stop soon. stopped. Well, it ran for about 10 minutes on that supercapacitor, but clearly the solar panel is not keeping the supercapacitor charged. And like I said, I should have left this connected up. And we would have known. Just hold that up so you can see it. Connect that on there. Wow. Right the way down to a quarter of a volt. And still going down. So. The motor, even though it's not turning, is drawing current. 
And if I hold that right up there, does that make any difference? Yes. It's going back up again. I'm holding the solar panel right up against the halogen bulb. So it might work. It certainly isn't what I'd planned to be doing. But that certainly is going up again. As long as you got really... Oh no, it's going down again now. I'll probably move my hand a bit. Yeah, you've got to have the hand in exactly the right place. Because I have got the other solar panels that have got more power. So it, it might work. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave us a comment so I know I'm doing. And somewhere up here there'll be some links to related playlists. Thanks again.